A week ago, Monday, uh, myself and six other members of the freshman class in Congress, all former military or former CIA, wrote a joint op-ed and came out in support of an impeachment inquiry. And I wanted you Whoa! to know from me, I wanted you to know from me, decision because sometimes there are some moments in life that are beyond politics and I felt that this moment was that a foreign leader and asked him to dig up dirt on an American on a So, so this is something the president himself acknowledged. This is something that the president's lawyer acknowledged. This is something, this is not, he's not disputing that fact. What he is disputing, and I acknowledge it completely, is whether there was a quid pro quo, a trade for our military assistance in exchange for information and dirt. And that is to be determined. There was that. Okay, that is to be determined. But here's the thing. So I have no special knowledge about the vice president, former vice president, or his son. I don't know anything special about it. But if you're the president of the United States and you have concerns that an American citizen is involved in something bad, you go to the FBI. You go to American law enforcement. That's where you go. You don't, I'm sorry, you don't go to a foreign leader. Because today it's the Ukrainians, and what's to stop some Democratic head of state going to China and saying, could you just do a quick cyber intrusion on this political guy over, or, this, or this American citizen over here? I just don't, if Americans can take care of our own problems. Maybe we can problems. have Obama's phone calls to Iran and China. 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 When you go to a junior park like that and ask well, for a when favor, he, yes, he, he congratulated him and then he, but he did, he did for ask for a favor, sure. ma'am. In the transcript, he did ask for a favor, and that favor, as we are, we now it is up to us to understand. Because he really didn't say favor. So this is why he did say favor. I'm sorry, the transcript says favor. And he, he did he did say favor. Um, and what I would say is, for me, that was enough to start an inquiry. Now, if there is different facts to be borne out, if there's more information to bring to the table, that should come out, and we should be. I, I'm, I, for me, involving foreigners in our political affairs was beyond the pale. It just was beyond the pale. Nobody is ever going to investigate Hunter Biden. Okay, so the administration is run by the president. He runs the FBI. If he was interested in a true and thorough investigation, he literally could just ask his director to do it. That is the way we do law enforcement in this country. But you have my commitment that I have not made a decision, that I will look at the facts as they come, um, and I will do what my conscience calls me to do. That you have my commitment. Always going to disagree. We've always disagreed. Um, you know, Democrats and Republicans have always had differences, but they've been able in the past to discuss things respectfully, and that's what I ask um, of everyone who comes to these events: is that we be able to do it respectfully.